Hey guys, it's me, Edward Vane, and let's talk about InPlay. Okay guys, let's go. Alright guys, so let's start with what is InPlay. So InPlay, or InPlay Gears PH, is a tech company, you know, just like Red Dragon, but it is a Philippine computer tech company, like that. So it sells PC products, such as keyboards, fans, mice, yeah, but it is a Philippine company. All of, their, all of their products are manufactured from China. Again, just like GigaWare and just like, and just like Red Dragon. Now, is it good? Are the products that they sell good? Well, InPlay is known for their budget products, such as their mice and keyboard combo. So this is the most co common keyboard and mouse that they sell, the STX360. Now, I've made a review of this months ago. I'll leave a link if you guys want to watch that. So they sell budget, budget computer gear or computer tech. So let's start with the mouse and keyboard. So the S STX360 is only for 250 to 300 pesos. Okay, it's a membrane keyboard, but it's RGB. So if you want to get an RGB keyboard and mouse and you don't care if it's mechanical, if you're just using it as a membrane keyboard, or if your son is doing just schoolwork, but he wants to have a stylistic, or I mean a stylish mouse and keyboard, then he or she should buy this. Now again, it's only 250 to 250 to 300 pesos, so of course it's not that durable at all, and of course since it's a membrane keyboard, you know, the keycaps might fade away, like I had that problem with me, but like I said, you get what you pay for, it's 300 pesos. But don't get me wrong, they have really nice stuff as well. They provide budget products and they also provide good quality products as well, based on my experience. Now, one of their products that I really do like is their RGB fans. As you can see behind me in my CPU, I use InPlay fans. Actually, a lot of Pinoy's do use their RGB fans because one, they're budget friendly. Number two, their RGB is great and you can change their colors as well. And they all sync up together using a RGB hub that they do provide in their three in one set. And like I said, they provide this remote with lots of colors. That's three, six, nine, twelve. 13, 14 different colors for their fans. And I do have to say their fans are pretty durable and nice. And I prefer to get the white one because it shows really great RGB. Now, most of their keyboards are membrane, okay? But they do light up nice, but of course they're not the best. Like for example, the InPlay STX360 only has two light modes, the default mode and a breathing mode, okay? So if, you, if you're not a gamer, if you just like to do office work, that's something that you can get. But again, not that durable. But I do have to say, they have a mechanical keyboard that's really good. They have the... They have the KS188, which I did have, but I, you know, gave it away to my cousin who wanted a mechanical keyboard, and he deserves it more than I do. And I've made a review of that as well on my channel. I'll leave a link as well for that. Now, it has a steel surface, so it's very durable. So this mechanical keyboard has a metal surface, and it has blue switches. It has 20 lighting effects, which is incredible. And I also like its durability. It has no flex because its, it's base is made of steel. You, it's a mechanical keyboard so you can mod it and also you can switch for keycaps as well. Costing only 800 to 1000 pesos only. So that's good. And another thing that I do like about InPlay is their cooler. So this cooler over here costs you about 2000 to 2100 pesos. And as you can see at the back, I did use it. And I do absolutely love it because the cooler is also RGB. All AIO or all in one coolers are RGB as well. Now, if I test the Afterburner, if you don't know what Afterburner is, it is a software that you can use to check the temperature of your CPU. And in standby mode, like for example, I'm not using or doing anything here, or if I'm just browsing, my CPU's temperature is around 38 degrees to 42 degrees Celsius. If I'm playing Valorant, it reaches up to 48 to 55 degrees Celsius. It doesn't reach 60 at all, so that's that's incredible for me. So I think the I really think that this combo over here, this cooler paired with their fans as well, is a really good deal. So if you're gonna buy these two, they're about 2,700 pesos. So 600 for this, 2,100 for this. All right, so five fans and a cooler, amazing RGB. Now another thing that I do want to point out for InPlay is they also have a very nice gaming table as well, an RGB gaming table as well. I put the specs over here, and you know a lot of people use it. A lot of people use it for their setup. Now I do want to point out that I'm not quite sure if you can use dual monitors for this. I'm sure that you can use a dual monitor, but the other one is vertical. It's the T setup monitor, but. I do strongly believe if you're going to buy their table, try to only have one big monitor so you can so you can have the right amount of space and you can also put your CPU there as well. 
and the gaming chair. Now, their gaming chairs are quite good. Some have wheels, some have don't, but I recommend you buy this one because this is their best gaming chair. So it ranges about six to seven thousand, which is all right. I think you can find a store that sells it for only five thousand only. So their gaming chair is like this. So when it comes to gaming chairs, I want you to know that the important thing about gaming chairs is that number one, it should be comfortable. Number two, it should have wheels. But there are some people who don't prefer to use gaming chairs with wheels because they don't move their chairs around. Another thing, they should have they should have comfortable pillows and they should decline as well. And this is well debated, a footrest. Okay, some gaming chairs have it, some gaming chairs don't. But to be honest, guys, I thought having a footrest would be good, but I don't really use it often, and I haven't met a friend that uses their footrest on their gaming chairs. I mean, there are a lot of high-quality gaming chairs out there like Razer or Secret that don't have a footrest at all. In in place case, they don't have a footrest, but they have adjustable gaming chair. I mean, sorry, they have adjustable gaming chair arms, but you can rise up like this because that is more useful because sometimes you're playing like that or playing like this. It's very good. So anyway, is InPlay good? Yeah, it's good. Do they have good quality products? Yes, they do. Do they have ch do they have cheap and you know fragile products as well? Yes, but, but again, it's not a rip off. A rip off is when you pay a lot of money and then the product that you get is crap. Here, your the expensive stuff of InPlay or the pricier side of InPlay is actually good. And of course, the cheap stuff, of course, since they are cheaper, easily breakable and fragile. So my top ten or so, sorry, top products that I have to say about InPlay is number one, their mechanical keyboard, number two, their fans, number three, their all-in-one cooler, of course, that's great, their gaming chair, and last but not least, their gaming table as well. And one other thing I almost forgot to tell you guys, I absolutely love their mouse. The name of that mouse is the M066. It's a gaming mouse, and I have to say, this is hands down their best mouse, and maybe even the best product InPlay has to offer. Why? Because it has a honeycomb design, it has amazing RGB, it's lightweight, a lot of people say that the heavier the better when it comes to my mouse and keyboards, but nowadays uh, light mice are trending and the quality is nice. Actually, I have a review for it as well. It has amazing side buttons, although a little deep. It has a DPI button and has all the buttons that you need like that. It's not perfect, of course, but for 250 pesos for a honeycomb mice that's built with good quality material and it's lightweight, good RGB, has the buttons you need, I think this is a real steal for you. So, anywho, I think that's all I have to say about InPlay. So InPlay is good with their chairs, their tables, their fans, their coolers, and their new mouse as well. So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you have any questions about InPlay, please comment below. Subscribe for more of my content. Okay, guys, bye.